Hi and welcome to the platform live. Here today we have Lucy Meyer. Hello. Hello. <laughs> so tell us a bit about yourself and what you do and what your um, music is. Well, I'm a singer songwriter, um, and I'm about to have my kind of debut EP released. It's kind of it's very much um, just me and a guitar. I have a very yeah. small half size guitar, um, and I sometimes use a loop pedal. Um, and yeah, I just kind of. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Okay, okay. So um, one of the songs on there is mm -hmm. particularly important to you, though, isn't it? Mm -hmm. uh, left behind. Left behind. Um, yes. Um, what is it? Tell it, us about it. Okay. Well, it's actually it's really deep. Actually, it, it's a bit kind of serious. Um, do you want to want to grab a cushion or anything? <laughs> <laughs> okay. No. Um, my one of my my friends. Um, she her she had a relative who committed suicide, and. Okay. Um, I just kind of wrote a song about it, and it was it. it I really like it, really like it. Um, Her personality. Yeah, 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 definitely. But I mean, all the songs on the EP mean a lot to me, or okay. mean mean a great deal. So, um, yeah, they're all pretty personal. Yeah. <laughs> Which one did you enjoy doing most? Oh God, I actually I think the first track on the EP is called "I Will Wait," mm -hmm. and. Um, it wasn't even. I I didn't really know what to do with it. I'd literally just written it, and um, I thought it was just. I didn't think it was going to turn out that good, and now it's w like one of my favorite songs on yeah, the track, simply yeah. because of how much it developed and how, like, grand it got. Like, there was there's so much on there, like so many tracks and so many instruments, and it's really cool. Mm. <laughs> I think it's cool. No, that's, that's good. You've got a single being released as well, haven't you? I do. It's out. Um, it was out September sometime, um, September fourth, I think, and it's on um, iTunes and Spotify and everywhere. Tesco's music. Mm. Oh, you're into that. <laughs> <laughs> no, that's good. It'll give like the fans an idea of where to find you and mm. what what mm. you're interested in as well, because mm -hmm. you generally find that they like what the artists like themselves. If that makes sense. Mm. So your music, who your your taste and, mm -hmm. and what have you, mm -hmm. what sort of derived that? So um, I mean. I, I always say this, but I'm a huge fan of Ed Sheeran. Okay. Um, and it's so obvious, but because uh, of the half size guitar and the loop pedal and whatnot. But um, he was kind of his first album. Um, plus, it's it was kind of the EP that made me think because the way he writes songs and the way he uses lyrics is really, it's really personal mm. and it's really like true. every single song yeah, is to him as it, well, it's isn't it? It's so yeah. honest, and I'd never really thought about writing a song like that, and that that, that was when I just thought that would be really cool if I could do that. Yeah. So I gave it a go, really. Ed Sheeran. So yeah, he's a big influence. And then I love people, I love like old jazz singers. Yeah, um, yeah. Like all the, re like the obvious, um, I'm not like a huge jazz geek, but like, so like Billie Holiday, mm -hmm. I love Billie Holiday. Um, Nina Simone, Ella Fitzgerald, uh, just all of them. I love it, it's so nice. Um, I like yeah. Nina Simone, it's very cool. She's so sassy, she's amazing, <laughs> I love her. <laughs> so you've got, um, I'm going to bring this up so the fans know, you've got a tattoo. I do, yes, <laughs> yes, yes I do. That's surprising, yes. it's like, I all, under all that sweetness. I, it's a little bit of edge. <laughs> that's, that's what my mum said actually. Oh, is that what she <laughs> my mom was she like, supportive, my mom, you need edge. Yeah, <laughs> um, yeah my, my, yeah. Actually, my parents were pretty cool about it. Yeah? I didn't tell my dad about it, and I just kind of, because it's behind me, it's like there. Oh, that's cool. Um, yeah, thank you. It's a good starter. Um, it's a good starter. It's a, yeah, but like I'm addicted now. Yeah. I, I left the tattoo parlor knowing the next one I wanted to get. Okay. So it's it's addictive. Yeah. yeah. You should get one. You should get one. You know, like next time we're going to be finding that she has <laughs> going to be covered. <laughs> I'm just going to be mental. Oh, no. You'll be coming out with music like Slipknots and things oh, like yeah. that next. <laughs> Major yeah. fan. Here. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so you're um you're doing is it A levels at the moment? Mm -hmm. Yeah, I'm in my last year of school. Okay, which is terrifying, but okay, yes, I'm, I'm ready to leave. <laughs> well, uh, good luck with those and what thank have you. you. And thank, thank you, you for much. coming to speak to us. No, no, no worries. Getting Thanks to know you. Me. Thank you. <laughs> All <laughs> right. <laughs> So thank you for watching the platform live. If you'd like to view us any more with anything different, you can find us on Facebook, Twitter, and YouTube. Thanks for watching. <laughs>